welcome back to a new video and in today's clothing haul I'm going to be reviewing Miss Pap, a website I've never actually shopped on before, my sister recommended it to me and I thought I would just check it out and place an order anyway. They came in two different separate bags and even when I placed the order on the website they sent me two separate confirmation emails as well. So yeah, I don't understand that part, but anyway, they're here. Hopefully the tops and dresses and everything that I got actually fits. I'm just gonna review them now and see how I think about them and see if they fit these massive boobs. So the first dress, oh sorry, I've already tried to open it. It's very mini, well it looks really mini, and it flows out at the bottom. Kind of looks like a ladybug. Feels all right. The sleeves are quite nice, the long sleeves. It looked really nice on the model on the website and that's why I picked it up. Don't know. Just gonna have to try this on because it, can, it doesn't look that pleasant holding it up like this, does it? So this is the first little nice dress that I have and I'm actually liking it a lot more now that it's on my body than when I was just holding it up. I feel like it's quite girly and it fits really nicely on my body, I like it. It's a very nice daytime dress. It's kind of tight on the arms though, you can definitely feel that that scratchy material on the arms. Other than that, I think it looks really nice. I kind of like the colour. They had this in a polka dot design as well, but I think I just chose this one because it had more sizes available. I'm actually really happy with this one. It looks kind of cute. Let me just come up close so you can see it a bit more. Yeah, I'm happy with this one. A thumbs up for me. I like it. So I'm just gonna start off with all the dresses first. This is the off the shoulder wrap dress. This, I believe, was £30, the original asking price, and I paid £9 for it. And the fact that I paid £9 for this makes me happy. I'm not a fan of off-the-shoulder dresses, I ain't gonna lie, because I like to wear a bra, and I don't like to wear strapless bras. And it seems quite plungy, like really low plunge, which I also don't like. This is more of like a laid-back kind of dress, daytime appropriate, daytime attire, whatever. Feels okay, yeah, like I said, it just seems a bit stretchy, so you could size down on this one, I'd say. I haven't tried it on yet, so. Oh my God, if I said anything bad about this dress, I take it back. Why does it fit so nice? And why does it look so nice? I'm absolutely obsessed. Oh my God, I love it. I'm not wearing any underwear right now, but I feel like you would be able to see my thong through this if I did wear one. But I don't give a, sh I don't give a shit because, ha! Huh? I just love it. I'm obsessed with the colour. Oh my god, I just love I love it. I'm gonna buy this in every single colour. And I'm also gonna get the body suit as well. I'm obsessed. Next dress, we have the low scoop neck backless. Oh, didn't really like it with backless. Bandage rib dress. This is nice. This is right up my street. Looks pretty small though. Oh, it's really cut out to the back. Can you see that? So yeah, I got this in a size eight and I know this is gonna be really tight fitting and I like tight fitting dresses a lot. Kind of feels like that kind of bandage material and I love bandage material. It sinks, it honestly sucks you in like no tomorrow. Um, yeah, but the top half of the dress obviously looks really small. I got it in a size eight and obviously they're not really catered for anyone with massive boobs. <laughs> but yeah, the color's really nice. I don't know if it's picking much on camera, but it's like a peachy, orangey color. Hopefully this fits though, because it does look pretty small. Okay, so this is a very nice, fierce little mini dress, isn't it? It's such a nice dress. I love the color on it. It has that kind of bandage material, so it really does sink everything in. And it shows like every lump and bump sort of thing. So if you're not comfortable with that and obviously this is not your type of dress but if you want something that's very tight sexy and just fits really well then this is not bad is it and then the back oh i've already got tan on this lovely tony honestly this is not bad at all i have another dress but it's a different type of dress something i don't normally buy at all actually because i just never know where to wear them and i don't think they suit me that much but i got the gold button double breasted blazer dress i feel like it's hard to get the right blazer dress because sometimes like it doesn't fit in the right way on most body types that's why they're so like this is why i don't really buy i don't really buy blazer dresses the sleeves are crinkle i don't wait what is that so sick? What's going on? I don't think it's gonna look good on me. But we'll just have to see. Okay, so this is the double-breasted button blazer dress. I'm actually considerably impressed with how these clothing of items are actually fitting me right now. I actually love this. Obviously you can see a tiny bit of my bra, but I could actually get away with not 
putting anything underneath. Like I could just wear my underwear under this. And I feel kind of classy in this. I kind of feel sophisticated. I love the red color. It is a tiny bit roomy at the top. This is a size 10, so there's a bit more room to fill out. It has like a little slit on the side as well. I don't know if it's worth 45 pounds, but for what I paid for it, which was like 13 pounds or something, ridiculously cheap, then I actually don't see nothing wrong with it. Moving on to tops now. And this is the tight front puff sleeve top in the color black. And I got this in a size 10. Hopefully this will not be too loose on the body. Oh, I wasn't expecting this material at all. Okay, so it's a thin material. And I don't mind thin materials as long as they're not too see-through. Oh, this actually looks quite nice, girls. I honestly thought it would be a lot thicker, like a ribby material, but it's not. But this is actually really nice. It's nice and casual. It's quite summery as well. So this was 20 pound originally, and I paid 10 pound for it. This is definitely not worth 20 quid though. This is a very pretty top, isn't it? I love that it's like got these two double ties at the front. It makes it so pretty. It's so basic, but so pretty. I really like it. Just paired them with some old random jeans that I have. But yeah, it's very light feeling. Like I don't feel like I'm wearing it a top. This would obviously go with a lot of things. This could actually be a really nice going out top as well. But yeah, it is a tiny bit small though. You can definitely see my bra like underneath if you look up close. I like it and it's cheap as well. Then we have this chiffon frill plunge bodysuit. Very mesh, kind of looks big as well. This kind of material, like it's not, doesn't have much elastic in it at all. So you should probably Maybe size up a bit. Yeah, this actually looks really nice. I like the chiffon, I like the mesh, I like that it's long sleeved. Yeah, it's quite thin. I feel like I could probably rip this if I really tried. If I literally just pulled that like that, it'd probably just rip. Like I'm scared to kind of hold it up. And yeah, the quality is a bit questionable from just holding it up because I feel like I'm just gonna break it. Like I can't even explain it, like it just seems so fragile. I was literally trying to get into this for like 10 minutes. I couldn't get it on like the normal way. Like you know when you get on trousers like that. I had to put it over my head but then my boobs got stuck. It was quite a struggle getting into this one. So yeah it's not there's not much elastic at all in this. I don't know if you can see but I've already ripped the top. <laughs> I've already ripped the top. I feel like I could oh, probably rip so this annoying. if I really Try, try, try. That's try, so try, annoying. Try. Will you be able to see that? Oh, yeah, I can't go up that far. I look like a scruff. But it looks so nice on. I'm so gutted. But yeah, I probably would need to size up on this one. I know that it's on. I can, like, kind of move in it. But, like, getting into it, and obviously there's a zip on the side as well. It was just a bit of a struggle to get in. So definitely size up if you're going to get this one. Okay, so the next one I have is a bralette. This is the ring detail double layered. Ooh, lash. That's good. It's not going to be see-through. I love the fact that it's double layered. And would you believe I got it in a size 14 this time. So this should definitely fit my boobs. And if not, then I give up. Okay, so this is the ring bralette. I love this bralette, right? I could have probably sized up, actually. This is a size 14. And I feel like with these kind of tops anyway, for anyone with big boobs, this is just going to look so booby, isn't it? My friend has really small boobs. And these type of tops, bralettes, whatever, they look amazing on her. Brass girls with us big fat boobies. It just looks a bit too much, doesn't it? I don't know if it just kind of seems like a bikini top. I like this is considered like a going out top, isn't it? I'm not sure if I'm in love with this. I don't know why I bought it. I thought it would look, I don't know why I bought it, but it is a cute top for people with smaller boobs. Or if you can rock this with big boobs, then that's great as well. But I don't know, I don't know if I like it on me. Right. So, for you lot that don't think I can't cover up, this is the high neck polka dot blouse. I actually fell in love with it straight away. I think this was like the first top I put in my basket actually. It has a little bit of stretch to it. And it flows down to the bottom. It's not tight fitting at all, I don't think. This is actually gorgeous. And I'm happy I picked this up. I just hope it looks really nice on. Okay, so this is the polka dot blouse. What do we think of this one? It looks nice, I think. Does it? It kind of makes me look flat chested in a way. Does it? Does it look like I have boobs? From this mirror, it looks like I have none. But yeah, what do you think? I think it's kind of cute. It's kind of cute. I like it. I really like it. Okay, that's a wrap. That's the end of my Miss Pap haul. What do we think? I'm very impressed with the dresses. I'm really happy with how they fit. There are really nice dresses, actually. Out of everything, the dress seemed to be more fitting on my boobs than anything. The tops were definitely a bit small. And it is actually size up as well. The size and other tops are a bit small. So if you're going to shop 
on Miss Pap and you have big boobs then yeah obviously you have to size up unfortunately. Overall it's a thumbs up from me, I'll definitely order from here again. The material is really nice, sorry, it actually feels decent quality, some of the things are a bit meh. They are kind of thin, if you don't like that kind of material then you wouldn't really like these tops or dresses. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Please like and subscribe um, if you want to see more clothing hauls or please comment down below what videos you would like to see from me and I'm happy to, to change it up a bit. But yeah, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.